Hello everybody, welcome to the CCL quarterfinal between Andy Devo and Dionysian, uh, season 41. In the booth with me is Faimir. Hello. Hello, here we are to see uh, one of the classic bash games, Dwarves vs Orcs. And Dionysian is a little down in TV, just, just a little, just enough to get Morgan Thor and a wizard. <laughs> yeah. So that's nearly 600 TV on a bribe. <laughs> and a bribe, yeah. On a bribe, Jesus Christ. Well, I mean, the, the, the amount of icons on the orcs just says everything. Yes, this is an absolute monster team. Um, I, I was saying the other day, I wouldn't even want to play this with my rebel team, my best ever like rebel chaos team, I still wouldn't want to play against this old team. Like obviously there'd be a chance of just hammering it, but I still wouldn't want it. Like it's it's monster, monster team, isn't it? Um, terrifying really. So it's the yeah. dream of every uh, or coach. Yeah. Even even with the race, even with the best team that I've ever had of the of the race that basically hard counters it, <laughs> still wouldn't want to face it. <laughs> it's ridiculous. There's only two strength ups, um, but there's an adjunct, there's guard everywhere, mighty blow, frenzy, all sorts of things. It's absolutely Oh, double scale of that. Horrific. And he's got this turn one surf, probably. To the loner, yes. I mean only two strength ups, for God's sake, that's a black strength five black orc. <laughs> yeah. That thing can take down Morgan Thor with just a little help, and that's it. Loner gone. That was a bit that was a bit of a bad setup, right? I'm not being I'm not being massive Oh it was it was it was perfect defense, wasn't it? It was okay. perfect defense yeah, for say, uh, this guy's not hitting anything. I mean, he could have done the surf that way, but yeah, no. Yeah. That was perfect defense from Ty. My apologies. <laughs> Because I'm like, with all that frenzy, you could have just done it with blocks, but no, it's perfect defense. So yeah, I mean, obviously Devo's a huge favorite in basically every every game he plays in this, but that hasn't stopped him <laughs> in the previous chalices. <laughs> yes, yes, that's true, and that ball is not particularly safe, I mean... That's against the isn't it? So, some dwarves, yes, but you can put a lot of pressure on the ball there. That's hard. It's so hard, though. Like, the, the, it's so hard with the dwarves. If they could have got more, like, if this was Blood Bowl 2020 and they could get uh, Griff, then the wizard would be pretty exciting for them, wouldn't it? But... Wait, uh, wait. Dwarves can get the uh, Griff on 2020? Yep. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, pro doing a thing there. <laughs> Glorious. <laughs> <laughs> there is a thing of, of uh, Andy's team is so strong, so strong that he said they have an alignment uh, with dirty player. You know, there's the classic uh, orc uh, yeah. lineman there. You know, is it like there is no space for it? <laughs> it's just another guard. Well, two guards, isn't it? Two guards more. <laughs> two guards. It's just infinite guard. I mean, to be fair, this makes the frenzy amazing, right? Like the the frenzy orcs is a bit of a meme, but then it's not a meme now because they've all got bloody four skills, at least, haven't they? They've all got. Oh no, actually, this one's got strength instead of guard, but they've all got block, frenzy, mighty blow, and it's just it's horrible. Like you ha you can't stop them. You just can't stop them because they've got they've got like what ten guard? Oh no, nine guard because the strength up doesn't have guards. They've got nine guard. And they've got loads of strength, and they've got loads of frenzy. It is an absolute nightmare team. <laughs> You've really got to dice them to stand a chance, no matter what your team is. And yeah. how good yeah, they is, uh, are. <laughs> or uh, the other chance is that Andy tries to make one of his uh, spectacular plays. Yes. And invest too much on it. Yeah. Like, you can hope for an Andy Devil mistake, but... It's even even if he makes a massive mistake, the team still got a good chance to bail him out. Even if he did, even if he, even if that small chance happens, <laughs> so like it's horrible. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> this team plays plays itself. I mean, just click a piece, and things happen. You know, like uh, you don't have to even think much. Yeah, yeah, it's it's just brutal. It's just absolutely, it's it's an insane. I can't, I can't hype it up enough. 
people are like were saying, you know, like the, the matches were, were the, weren't that one-sided. And I'm like, yeah, they are. I mean, come on, I've got eyes. <laughs> These matches are horribly one-sided. And it's not to say that Blood Bowl dice can't happen. You know, obviously anyone can get dice in any game, can't they? But like, like, Andy, Andy's having a use in a Mr. Throw, so that's a guaranteed, you know, giving you 10% less of winning a game. <laughs> yeah. But if he was terrible at Blood Bowl, then yes, I could, you know, like you often see people playing on stream, don't you, like versus the streamers, yeah. and they're just terrible at Blood Bowl, and they've got a 500 TV advantage and they lose, like you see that all the time, but he's, you know, he's not like and that, I, is he, yes. so, so, <laughs> so it's just, it's just absolutely horrible. And I think uh, Dio just throw away the drive without the red dice, not rolling or anything, he's just... That's it. Just lie down for the half because, the good, as you say, the good thing is there's no mighty, there's no dirty player on this team. So now you just lie down because your whole team's surrounded. So this is actually because his team is so good. It's uh, oh god, he's gonna surf more, isn't he? <laughs> that's that's what I'm thinking. You know, that's what I'm thinking. I have so many chains. You know, <laughs> can you imagine uh, Andy Devil loving every moment? Yeah, <laughs> chains. Surf. But yes, it's happening. It's happening, lads. <laughs> oh dear. The old frenzy orc getting to serve. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, when Morg's getting surfed with nothing special, just literally getting 2D all the way, that's, that's bad times, isn't it? Well, at least he's not dead. Yeah. And now, just click, pass down, that's yeah. it. Yeah, the half's over the time on now. It's alright, you still, you still have the wizard, it's just a couple chaos. Oh. And he's only got 13 players, so like... He's not really going to want to foul with a guard. Is he? he does have a dirty player, actually, just not fielding it. <laughs> so he's got a dirty player as well. Yeah, I, I, I told you, I told you, you know, that, that's the thing, you know, the team is so good that you can't feel the dirty player. Like, <laughs> the players are so good. Are you good? <laughs> no, he shouldn't, he shouldn't have fielded Mr. Throw, should he? He should have, uh, he should have, he should have been carrying the ball on the dirty player. <laughs> Wait, he's trying to score in the black hole. Yeah, why not? Yeah, you're right. So it's the sad reality of, of like of the, of the opponents that he's got. Like the, no one can match up to him. Can the, the team is, is so good. Nope. Okay. This is, a way this, he is score. <laughs> <laughs> this is much better odds than if if Diode defended desperately. <laughs> yeah, two times for the Orcs to score. <laughs> nah, it's given up on the black hole. Rick wouldn't have. Rick would have. <laughs> Rick would have still been on. I still have a talent. Okay, good, good. <laughs> Flip me, guys. He's on 13 as well, so it's actually totally fine. It's going to throw, isn't it? Okay. When as expected, but not that many casualties for the, the dwarves, so happy days there. Yeah, yeah, that was the thing. He was too adept at knocking people down and guard locking because then there was just literally no point in Dio trying to defend against it. So it actually worked against him making permanent removals, didn't it? The, the team being so good. <laughs> but I think it's going to work in his favour um, in the second half. Yes, yeah, so he's got 11 players, Dio hasn't he? So Dio has 11 players, has the wizard, has two LOS hits with pylon. And a Morg, a Mighty Blow. So if he is lucky, he can get a couple of removals. And because every single player of uh, this team has skills, you know, it's always good. Yeah, yeah, you can get, you can get what? A Palm, two Mighty Blow hits, and a dirty player foul here. Um, yeah, Spartan yes, because... was a game, and I wasn't the one who conceded. Unbelievable. <laughs> And, uh, yes, and Dio also has the bribe, so... Yeah, he's definitely fouling, yeah, 100%. A couple uh, good shots. 
And things could be very different for the second half. Not very different, but <laughs> you can have the slim chance. Like that. There's always a chance, isn't there, in Blood Bowl? There's always a chance. And yeah, if he makes two or three removals here. Um, well, if he makes three, and he's down to ten, isn't he? But if he makes two, then at least it's a player quality change. At least it will make, you know, the, the second LOS hits be more interesting. Yeah. Not knocking down with my Ebro, Jim Shark. Oh, oh, he's already in contact. I say he's blocked his mighty blow blitz, but he's already in. Oh, he's not fouling. That's fair enough. Because it means now he can foul the whole second half. He's only got 11 players, right? So he can. It means he can foul the second half. But he has a bribe. Oh. Yeah, but it means he's got the bribe, hasn't he? So, like, by not fouling now. If he'd fouled now and got sent off, then he hasn't got a bribe, so he can't foul for the second half. And if he made a KO, it does nothing because Andy's got 12 players. Well, he's got 13 players. So, like, removing that Lino, he didn't even field him last half, did he? <laughs> so, removing no, that well, Lino wouldn't have been worth the bribe. I would have gone for one of the guard uh, Lino. Yeah, yeah, true, true. But even then, I don't know, I think it's better to save it for this half where a KO removes him for sure. Whereas, uh, you know, like for the rest of the drive, isn't it? A KO removes him for the drive now. Whereas a kill there might not have removed him for the drive, but might have that's too much. That's it. too much thinking. Yeah. I'll go for the high roll <laughs> and pray away. Fair enough. I mean, that is probably what right, to be fair, against this team. That's usually going to be a good idea. Pray for high rolls, <laughs> and that's it. Yeah. I mean, yes, but both options are good because also Dio is not as that much range of movement here, you know. Yeah. To do just oh <laughs> Jesus Christ Almighty, okay, that's it. <laughs> oh well rip your LOS blocks. <laughs> Get fucked. <laughs> Somebody stop the damn match. <laughs> and now you can guard log the I mean he could have knocked some down if he didn't get blitzed on. <laughs> Well, maybe this guy could have gone in there. I don't know. Maybe he's got to go in there to support him because it's the. He can make blocks here. This is. Uh... I don't. I don't like letting him make any blocks. To be honest. With the amount of strength that Dandy has and guard, yes, is the, the fact that the dwarves can get two dice is amazing. Yeah. Geneva Convention has banned things that aren't as bad as this. <laughs> yep. Oh dear. Yeah, Tony is okay. awesome, isn't it? Awesome news. Wow, that is that is a good removal. No power. All right, all right, all right. Yes, the lobbies on the personalized lobbies on the storybook world. Now people can make competitions. Um, so yeah, and, and, and actually you saw this against Rick in the round of 16, um, in the, and he's like obviously thinking about Chalice Equity as well, right, he, hand, he handed off to that Black Hawk, he's not, he's not power appoing that, that Black Hawk there, he's absolutely thinks he's like, he's going to win overtime, right, which is, well, look at his team, <laughs> so, <laughs> so there's, and there's never too much motivation to go all in, and I guess that's what he thought, like, you know, yes, he could have based everybody up there. And he could have, like, you know, denied hits and everything. But then what if one of the Wandies is a Pow and a Kaz? And then, you know, then it... You know, it, Dio could have probably made a Wandie, right? And then that Wandie could crack open the line and stuff. So I guess he was yeah. just trying to be to be safe in that regard. And he's not I mean, really trying too hard to win any of these games. Like, <laughs> scarily, he really isn't trying too hard to win any game except the final. <laughs> And Dio more or less managed to get a decent position there, so you know, there's a lot of orcs that are not very useful right now. So he's, he's just, again, it's exactly the same as Andy, uh, I guess Andy, again, as against Rick. He's, you know, opening the red carpet, he's not really defending the sideline. He's not, you know, it's, because it, who cares at the end of the day. If they score on you, you'll just beat them in overtime. Like, basically guaranteed. <laughs> Mm. 
So he could play a lot more aggressive defense if he wanted. Yes. <laughs> well, J5. I mean, that's second skill before block. That's pretty. That's pretty hardcore. But yeah, after block and mighty, he's a bit lame. After mighty blow and strength is is pretty. Uh, it's pretty good. And yeah, after mighty blow before. I mean, taking it after mighty blow before block. That's uh, that's pretty good. Can't argue with this. I mean, you want to defend it a bit, right? So I feel he wants to defend it a bit. He basically didn't defend at all against Rick. No, oh, and uh, nearly paid the price there because Rick uh, Cooper got uh, a couple of good shots. Yeah. I mean, he, he can't go like uh, he can't go like uh, what's he called? Monty Puff Puffs Canny J Five, you know, like I've. I've never, re me and Andy Dave, I've never really, you know, seen eye to eye in the past or anything, but uh, even I wouldn't criticise him for not taking the Frenzy first skill. <laughs> like, he's still taking it eventually. That's that's Frenzy. That's Frenzy Black Ops. That's fine. And even if he doesn't take the eight first or something like that, Frenzy is not a common skill on uh, Black Orcs anyway. Yeah. I mean, it's certainly paid off now, hasn't it? These are like... Big time. I mean, for a player that knows so much about the making position, chains and sharps, having friends with that many players, it's like a blessing. A strength four, so yeah. And when you've got nine guards to back it up. Yes. <laughs> nine guards. He's got the edge four here for the ball hit, hasn't he? So easy 2D on the ball. I guess Dio's plan is to like wizard and get it back or something. I don't know. Oh, balls in the crowd. Oh god, right in front of Morg. What a time to be alive. Morg potato! Morg potato! <laughs> he had to he had to get this guy down first, didn't he? Like he just had to. Because if he's got no reroll, if he dub skulls that, and then there's no one near the ball. But um, I mean, Morg just just goes for one D here, isn't it? And then Morg can uh, Morg can two D the ball and pick it up and run away. Yep. No need for a wizard. Morg to the rescue. There you go. Time to earn that money, Morg. <laughs> also, it's good that he's doing all these rolls beforehand because end of the day you can re-roll a uh, Morg's uh, rolls. Uh... Not easily, no. I mean, he's got four, and he's got no other shot. <laughs> so if he has I, to, uh, run, okay. There, I will uh, even risk the loner there. Yeah, maybe. And try a re-roll. Maybe, because if you can pick it up and run away, you're, go you're golden, aren't you? But then if you're going to do that, maybe you should just bolt him and then go for the pickup. I don't know. Maybe not. You don't really want to rely on Morg, do you? Like, that's the problem. Finally makes a removal. This half. Oh. Looks like he made one already. Didn't notice, but I mean, he was down too, wasn't he? So it wasn't that great for him before now. <laughs> Fails the dodge? Got to reroll this. Yes, yes, you have to. <laughs> now he could bolt the ball and blitz with Morg and pick it up, couldn't he? <laughs> like, Morg's his only chance in this game, it's hilarious. <laughs> a team a team of orcs with a team of dwarves with loads of mighty blow and guard and he's literally just got to rely on the strength six star player. <laughs> there you go. And he does have the runner free, that's nice. He 
It's actually nine versus nine, isn't it? Yeah, it's more or less uh, all right. Oh, that would have been a a pow. Very unlucky rolls there by the uh, Dio. Yeah. He's got the ball though. There you go, there you go, more with the ball. Dreams come true. The dreams come true. <laughs> Oh dear. He's not blitzing with him. Interesting. He's just gonna like double base mark or something. Hello, little bears. I'm surprised you didn't go for the 1D blitz on Mark. I guess with one reroll, he wants to save that for over time, so he didn't want to use his reroll, so he wants to go as safe well, as he be... can. Also, Tony, to be honest, the name of the team is Frenzy Orcs 2. <laughs> it's not Frenzy First Orcs. <laughs> I mean, this is this is just easy, isn't it? Just blitz him and then dodge out on a 3+. Plus. I mean, there's no other yes. play to make. Just do the... Other uh, rolls before and now, yes. Yeah, for all this, you know, putting three men on him, it's not really doing a lot, is it? Oh, there you go, Mark. <laughs> Absolute legend. <laughs> oh. Okay, just surrounding. It was hard to hit him this time, to be fair. But last time it was just a two plus dodge. For a 1B. Now it's a blitz from Morg. Gets the pow. Oh, and Gets it the cast. Five <laughs> SPP play. Five SPP play. Morg. Morg the man. <laughs> and yeah, that gets him out of range of him, more or less. Can tag him. Yep. Yeah. Glorious player from Dial. Perfect 16 turn stall. <laughs> you can uh, put it on the books, you know, how to play Blood Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> Just do everything with Mark. <laughs> and a KO. And another removal. <laughs> wow. Else the apple went in on that guy. So yeah, all you can do is base him, isn't it? Definitely can't hit Morg now. I mean, not now that he's blitzed. Like, he could have uphill blitzed him, which would have been terrible, wouldn't it? Because what does it even do? <laughs> so yeah, just pom blitz. And base. He can dodge the double base. Dodge double G if I double base. And that double base is important because even if Morg blitz someone, it will still will be, you know, uh, an attack and so on. It doesn't put in the rerolls, it's just a, it's only a. It's only blitz like a and a score. Nine, or a double score. Oh! Oh! oh no. <laughs> no! Oh my god! Wow. Brutal. Absolutely brutal. <laughs> that is tragic.
for Dio reason. That was, that was very unlucky. Obviously there was luck in the rest of it, with him making his dodges and pickups and stuff, but that was super unlucky. Oh, fucking Morg! <laughs> Got a foul in there. Oh no, I just go for a pass. Yeah. Uh, how boring. How boringly correct. <laughs> I mean, there's no need when, when you're 100 SP, but you're not going to get 75 in the next two games. <laughs> complicated, 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 you know. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. Well, yeah, that was... Uh, didn't get the foul at all, did he, in the second half, actually? <laughs> so the, saving the bribe for the second half, I don't think he got to make one foul in the second half. So, yeah, maybe his foul in the guard in the, in the first half was better. Um, yeah, that that rabbit only got to make a single foul. Um, I'll give uh, Morg the MBF, the <laughs> most ma valuable fan. <laughs> yeah, I mean, who, that's 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 horrible. That's the kind of thing. Okay, only one in thirty-six here, you know, because even if it's one in nine, I can dodge with a three plus. And okay, there you go. Yeah. That's my childish career. Yeah, that is that was tragic, really. Uh, so close, so close to going overtime, and actually he wasn't doing that bad, was he? Uh, it's the second time. Camp. It's the second time that Andy has allowed someone to give uh, get chances that maybe they shouldn't get. Yeah, but that's the thing. That, I mean, that's the thing. He's always got the chalice equity in mind. So, to be fair, to be fair, um, you know, he's always approaching it from like he's got the inevitability. He's definitely going to win this match, whatever happens. Manifest, basically. manifest destiny. Yeah, he's, he's yeah, like, and it's right. He's right. His team is far, 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 yes. far, far better. So all he has to do is is get through each game as like smoothly as possible, with as many players alive, and you know, not giving away stupid blocks that can get them cast out randomly. And, I mean, uh, yes, and this team, you know, being able to sharp and mark <laughs> in the first half was like okay, and not much effort. I think I've only seen another uh, mark sharp. In the chalice and was with the uh, Agnalas run. Yeah. <laughs> where everything was absolutely crazy. Every single game was a complete, pure, distilled madness. Beautiful games. Glorious. Wow. Those uh, dwarf bleachers with a uh, side step first. <laughs> and then dot. <laughs> Jeebus. Beautiful. Beautiful. There you go. Congratulations, Andy Devo. Massive commiserations for Dio. That was that was what a tragic end for, to the to the glorious the glorious Morg Ball. <laughs> and uh, yes, thank you very much, Faimi. As always, glorious to have you back. Thank you very much. Thanks. Always a pleasure to be here. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>